while we're restoring uh, I'm not sure he's even it's just like uh, public land that has been disturbed by man, a logging operation 12 years ago that was not replanted, they never replanted. So we're taking care of that here a few years late, but we're, we're on it, we're trying to influence Mother Nature. What you're seeing are the very headwaters of the Duwamish. This is water right. that flows through here that eventually ends up in Elliott Bay. Right. So we're building a, a huge rain garden here is what we're doing. Yeah. If you want to call it that. That's a good time. Pretty much a natural rain garden that will filter the water before it gets to the lakes and provide better air to breathe. How did I get involved? I went through, I'm a kook, I went through WSU Extension Service classes and they turned me on to it. They said, we need you. They said, where do you live? And I said, well, here's where I live and about a quarter of a mile from here. So the next thing I know, they turned me into an ambassador of this complex. And uh, I just don't know how to say no. So. We had Cascade Land Conservancy bought some land out here. RCO bought some land out here. RCO is uh, a group out of Olympia founded by Dan Evans and Mike Lowry. And they have funds for conservation work. Oh, there's REI. Got us started here. REI gave us the money to get, they gave us the first grant money here uh, because they're all about restorations and trails. REI is uh, within, what, 30 miles about in Seattle. And the Tuck Willis store is actually the one that did this outreach. Each site is unique and trying to make a carbon copy out of restoration sites is the wrong direction. People don't realize that once, when a place is logged here in the Northwest, the bad plants grow back much higher rate and crowd out the good native plants. Mark's a neighbor and I'm a neighbor and so it depends on how far you look at the neighborhood. We had a few neighbors here earlier, Trip Hart's a neighbor, he was here. Mike Nelson. Mike Nelson, Marianne Nelson, there are quite a few neighbors that have been here. The momentum is growing I guess because from year to year, this is our second year on this site. And we've had twice as many people this year as we had the year before. So if we can double that next year, then yes, we are. Increasing awareness and the outreach is getting better and better each year as we go along. And as we learn how to explain it better as well. Everybody can be a steward. Well, I just added up this one about 40 hours, I would say. Between the mailing, we mailed 500 letters. We did a bunch of posting, we did posters, we did some Facebooking and all kinds of different things like that. <laughs> okay, but anyway, get a hold of me again because we'll, we'll, we'll um, do. I don't do like Mary Moore, but anything along the green. The, well, Mary Moore, all, that, all the people up north, they have so many people, they get all kinds of people. Oh, okay. Out here, we're, we need more people. Okay, right on. Yeah, so that's great.